Hello guys, I am um, just putting up a little vid log this morning. Um, basically, what I'm doing in this video, I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna de dedicate this little video to our little cat. Um, basically, our our little cat, he uh, he went out last night. Well, he's he is little, yeah, he's, he's about eight now. And, um, goes out last night, comes back this morning, and he's falling all over the place, and you don't know whether he's coming and going, and... Pardon me. You, you, well, you can see he's ill. You can see he's, he's really ill. Um, so anyway, he took him down the vets this morning, and, um, it appears he's gone blind. Now, he was fine last night, and even early this morning, he was still working his way around things. But as the morning went on, he gradually lost his eyesight, and he's gone blind. Um, they did a look in his in his eyes, and um, it looks like he's hemorrhaged behind his eyes, which has caused him damage to his eyes. So it's unlikely he's ever going to be able to see again. So the life that he knows it has has finished has ended really he's um he's gonna have to stay indoors and be a house cat now or he's going to be blind for the rest of his life but basically what i'm trying to what i'm what i want to urge people is not to use rat poison because i'm not 100 percent sure i mean he's at the vets now they're doing kidney tests and all sorts on him but for something to happen that quickly I think, personally, I think it's probably rat poison. Um, I expect, because I've heard other stories around here where I live, um, similar stories have happened. So I get the feeling that there's somebody around here that thinks, oh, I don't like cats coming and crapping in my garden, so I'll put some poison down for them, which it, I think's probably happened. Um, I think he's found some food or he's or he's maybe found a, a little mouse or something which has um, been impregnated with rat poison. Now this stuff you can't buy off the shelf. This is stuff that the prof only the professionals can give out. Um, now it's licensed, I think. I think the stuff is licensed. Um, what it does, it actually... It causes causes the animal or the the, the rat to um hemorrhage and basically bleed from the inside out and um that's how they die so if he's had the same it goes to the weakest point first which in his case is going to be you know it's going to be behind the eye it's going to hemorrhage here first which has knocked his sight out well they're flushing him through with fluids so hopefully he'll, um, hopefully he'll be okay so we we'll just have to wait and see but Basically, this video is just to tell people of the dangers of using rat poison. You, you might get rats in your house, your mice in your house, all this stuff. I mean, we've had mice in here. I mean, the way I see it is, you know, they're entitled, they're much, as much entitled to this piece of land as anybody else. Just because we've put a house on it. I mean, they're entitled to a bit of warmth and a bit of something to eat. Um, I guess I'm a bit biased because we used to have rats when I was uh, a few, well, about ten or so years ago. We had a couple of rats, but <laughs> that's besides the point. But um, yes, don't please don't use poisons. Please don't use poisons because it does it does not going in not always just going to the animals that you want to kill. You know, please encourage people not to use them because, you know, thanks to these, well, if they've put it out on purpose, then um, they're just sick. Thanks to these sickos, our cat's now blind for the rest of his life and he can't now see. But, um, I will be investigating it and when I find out who's done it, they will get prosecuted because you're not allowed to use stuff like this. Well, not as far as I know. I might be wrong, but um, I think it's regulated because it's it's it is a poison. It's poison. 
and um, if they've got it, they've got it from, you know, they got it from the wrong way, or the, well, you know what I mean. <laughs> yeah, anyway, if you can, uh, if you guys can send us some positive energy and um, a bit of luck and warmth and love for our little cat, then it'd be much appreciated. So, anyway. I'm sorry if this was a bit of a downy video, but I felt I had to share it. So, um, thanks for watching. Peace in every step, and I'll see you in the next vid. Cheers, guys.